We're closed. Is he? Oh, he's okay, yeah. Well, he sat up in bed telling the nurses all about his glittering career, bless him. Mm. Ah, well, that's some good news anyway. I think it scared him, though. I'm glad I stuck around to hold his hand. By the sounds of it, he hasn't got anyone else. You're a good woman, Glenda. I bet you weren't saying that after I blew the deal slagging off Benny all over the mic earlier. <sighs> Daisy text. Said it won't go news. It was nothing to do with you. Hey, and listen. Nobody treats my stuff like that. I should have belted in one for you. So what was the reason? We're just not profitable. Well, you've made it this long. You'll work something out. I have faith. Well, I'm glad someone does. Hey, and if I were you, I take a leaf out of Scarlet O'Hara's book and think about this tomorrow. Be as knackered as I am. Can't wait to crawl into bed. Hey, do you fancy a nightcap? Never wear them. <laughs> hey. I don't care what anyone says. This place is a goer. We'll find a way to make it work, yeah? Right, that's me. Night, love. Night, boss. <gasps> Don't forget to lock up. Yeah, okay. Hi, um, this is Jenny Connor of the Rovers Return pub covering Nation Street. Um, could someone please give me a ring first thing? Um, on this number, thanks. Bye. And if you're a huge fan of the show, then you won't want to miss the Coronation Street experience. Step